Hey, what up, what up, what up? It's your boy, Jedi King Hefner, and the beautiful Saima Renee Uzumaki. And we're back again for another episode of Reset Sundays. And on Reset Sundays, we like to reset your mind, your body, and your spirit for the upcoming week. And the title of today's episode is Lean on a Friend. Lean on a friend. And what do I mean by that? We'll get to that right about now. Hey guys, I'm back again with the beautiful Saima Renee. And the title of today's episode is Lean on a Friend. And I got the idea to do this show because recently I was using my auntie's car and I had a big problem with one of her tires. The jack I was using malfunctioned and I needed some help. And if you know me, is one thing that I really don't like doing, and that's calling people for help. I really like to do things on my own without bothering somebody. But in this particular case, I really had no choice. And that's what God will do sometimes. He'll put you in a position where you have no choice but to do what he wants you to do. And since he knows I'm reluctant to call for help, he put me in a position where I had to call for help. I didn't fight myself. I just listened to my spirit and made the call. One of my good neighbors didn't hesitate to come over here and help me out. And we got the tire changed and everything was A-OK. I still didn't love the fact that I had to call him, but I was so thankful that I did. I was glad that God put that whisper in my spirit to lean on a friend. I know a lot of you out there are just like me. You sort of struggle when it comes to asking other people for assistance. You'd rather do it on your own so you wouldn't have to worry about somebody saying no. But I'm here to tell you today, Sometimes you got to make that call. Sometimes you got to let somebody know that you need them. Recently, my grandmother sold her car. And for the first time since I can remember, she doesn't have any transportation. That means she's going to have to lean on people to take her from place to place. But she was telling me how she's not going to lean on anyone, she's not going to bother anybody, and she's not going to ask anybody to take her anywhere. And I told her, Grandmother, I'm afraid that's not going to be possible. You've given up your car. You don't have freedom of transportation. So you're going to have to lean on somebody. One thing you're going to have to do is allow somebody to help you. A lot of times, God answers prayers by using other people. But if we shun their help, or if we don't reach out to those that we need, we can't get that blessing that God is going to deliver to us through that other person. I know it's hard to do sometimes, but we have to let go of their ego and their do-it-myself mentality. I don't need anybody mentality. And we have to allow God to help us through others. Believe me, it's one thing that I've struggled with myself. But I'm here to tell you today, sometimes you can't do everything on your own. Use the people that God has put in your life. Don't be afraid to lean on a friend. So, with all that said, me and the beautiful Saima Rudne are going to read your declaration for the week right about now. Hey guys, this is your declaration for the week. I declare 
Everything that doesn't line up with God's vision for your life is subject to change. Sickness, trouble, lack, mediocrity are not permanent. They are only temporary. You will not be moved by what you see, but by what you know. You are a victor and never a victim. You will become all God has created you to be. This is your declaration. We really hope you enjoyed that episode of Reset Sundays, and we pray you have a blessed and abundant week lying ahead. So with all that said, we really love for you guys to hit those subscriptions and notifications. But as of right now, it's been me, J. D. King Hefner, and the beautiful Saima Renee Uzumaki. We are out.